Hey guys, welcome back to another Kayla's Curls. Today I will be showing you guys how I got this cute protective style, these four braids on my natural curly hair. So I'll be using my olive oil by ORS and I will also be using my Eco Styler Gel. This is the Max Hold and this is the olive oil um, formula. I also will have my wide tooth comb and a paddle brush. So yeah, let's get started. So of course guys, you know I like to start on my hair freshly washed. So this is my hair from a wash that I did a couple hours prior to this and it is dry and really brittle. So I thought that I would do a quick easy protective style, especially with the weather, you definitely wanna protect your hair. So let's get right into it. So I'm gonna start off by sectioning off my first braid and this is going to be like a pointed style braid from like the temples down to the nape and i will be doing four braids so i'm just going to do my first parted braid and then i will get started on the braiding process So now it is time to use my olive oil and my Equal Styler gel. So I will be adding a generous amount to my sections just because my hair is dry from a wash and go from a shampoo and condition. And I do recommend to do your braids on wet hair because I did have a hard time doing some of the braids as when your hair is dry, it's a lot thicker and it's a lot harder, especially if you don't add the right amount of products. So I'm just going to add in a good amount of olive oil and then I'm going to move on to the next step. I also wanted to mention do not forget to rub oil on your scalp as the dryness will show in your parted sections through your braids and it will not look good. Now that I've added my oil I'm just going to detangle my hair so that there's no nicks and cronies inside while you're doing your braids because this will be a hard task to braid if there is any tangles so be sure to detangle properly from ends to roots with the right amount of product or on wet hair so now to begin the braiding process, I'm just going to take a little bit of my Eco Styler Gel just to put in my hand. This is going to add some extra slip and also some extra hold. So I like to start my braid at the right top of the section and this is just going to make it look neat and perfect. Now some people do their braids differently like with their hands at the back or towards the back but I like to do the ones near to my ear from the side like how you see my hands right now so all I'm doing is just taking three pieces like I would if I was doing a regular single braid except I am adding pieces as I am going down so I'm gonna go ahead and do this first braid and then yeah I'm gonna move on to whatever I do next I do want to mention it is a lot easier to do your braids on your natural hair when your hair is wet or blow dried. So this is totally up to you if you like to do it how I did it or if you like to do it with wet hair or blow dried hair. Everyone has their own preference and I found this way for me. It is easier to do my hair on my hair while it's dry and I did have trouble along the way but you do learn through trial and error.
So this is what my first braid is looking like. It is looking great so far. So now I'm going to go ahead and do the second braid. And this is the braid that I had the most trouble doing. And it took about three different tries to get the braid to fully go down to the back of my nape because it was so hard to braid while it was dry. So I ended up adding so much more product to my hair just to help me to braid. So I'm gonna go ahead and braid the rest of my hair and just let you guys watch me as I braid my hair and then I will come back to show you guys what I do next. So, in this clip you guys will see that I did detangle a lot and this is because my hair was hard to braid because my hair was dry but with the right amount of products or even leaving your hair wet to the braids it should not be a problem but my braids still came out perfect so no complaints there. So this is what the first two braids are looking like. They are looking perfect and just exactly how I wanted it to. So now I'm going to go ahead and do the other side off camera so you do not have to sit here watching me do my hair all day. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and then I will be back to show you guys what I do next. Alright guys, so this is how my braids are looking like. They are looking perfect, just like how I want to, and I'm loving it. So, I am not done until my edges are done, so I'm just going to add a little bit of Eco Styler Gel to the temples of my hair, and just use a little old toothbrush of mine to lay down those edges just a little bit just to make it look neat and perfect so i'm going to go ahead and do my edges and then come back to show you guys the final results All right guys, so this is the final results. I think my hair came out amazing and this is a really quick and easy way to do a protective style, especially for the winter months. You know that you wanna protect your hair at all costs because you know that the winter is not going to be that great for your hair. So if you want to, you can add some extensions, but I like the natural look as my hair is long enough, so it makes it look great. I love how this looks. This is a quick and easy style. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching just as much as I enjoyed doing this style, and this style lasted me a pretty long time. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said before, I hope you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe so peace out and thanks for coming to what kayla's curls bye y'all